Hi guys, so today I'm going to show you guys how I made this runner rug. It was really easy and very inexpensive, so if you'd like to learn how to make one like this, then just keep watching. So first you will need some placemats, and I got these at Target. They were $1.98, so really inexpensive. They were on sale, but I'm not really sure if I would recommend these specific rugs. If you don't mind your rug being very thin, then sure. But um, they are pretty thin, uh, but they are cute. So yeah, I got four of those, so it cost $8. And right now I'm just taking off the price tags. And they are like double-sided, and I like the darker side better. So that's the part that I want to show. So I made this rug, this runner rug, two different ways. The first way was to sew the placemats together. So I got this, um, thing of string at Walmart, that white string in the left corner. I don't know how much it was, but you can use, you know, whatever string you want or yarn. And I'm just gonna sew them together. Now this does take a very long time. So yeah, if you want to do it this way, just it's gonna take a while. <laughs> but yeah, I just sewed each placemat together. like when you're done sewing them together and you are going to see a seam it is gonna look like individual mats sewn together but I personally like that look and I'm sorry it's all wrinkled I should have ironed it before I videoed <laughs> but after doing that I thought I would try a different way so I unstitched it I uh, took it apart and I used duct tape which was a ton faster and a lot easier because I thought I would try to make it look more like one rug and not have that seam from sewing. So yeah, just duct tape them together and it was very, very fast. decided to put some tape in a different direction than the other tape was going, if that makes sense, just to make it stronger, to make sure that it wouldn't come apart. end result you can still tell that they are individual placemats or like little mini rugs but I like that look and if you don't have a ton of money to spend on a runner rug because they can get expensive you know really pretty ones then you know this is a cool option and you can say that you made it yourself and here's another one that I made the placemats were a lot thicker though and I did sew them together with yarn 
And I really like how the yarn contrasts with the darkness of the placemats. And I like how the tassels are on the side of the rug instead of the end. It's unique. So here are both of them, the, the mats, I mean the, the rugs. The green one is so wrinkled though, I really should have ironed it before I videoed. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I hope this video was helpful to anyone who wants a runner rug and wants to make it at home. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching again and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Thank you.